Yamato Tamura. Back at Nations Cup, an odd start to this men's short program. A do-over, in effect, for Yevgeny Plushenko after the first 30 or so seconds of his program. He's in the lead over Zheng Jinguo of China and Trifon Zivanovic as Yamato Tomoro of Japan takes the ice. The Japanese champion in 98 captured the bronze in 99. picture Crimson Tide. Building up a lot of speed. Opening jump. Quad toe. Yes! Look how solid that was. The trick to that is in the beginning of the program, you don't want to rush your timing. He let it climb to the top, rotation followed, and that was the result. Look at the bend he gets before the second jump, allowing him to really get up in the air. Outstanding. spin close to the ice again on the second spin also pretty good what he's doing is systematically ticking off these elements without rushing him the timing or changing anything from his practice pace He makes it look easy. Great height. Oh, he's got to be happy with that. Wow, 20 years of age from Miyagi, Japan. Did not even make it to the World Championships a year ago. He finished 26th in 98. What a defining short program this has been for him to try to challenge the leaders at the top. Yamato Tamura. He had great height on this quad. Let's check to see that he doesn't touch down and have a two-foot landing. There's one, two, three, four. Look for the left foot. It didn't appear to me that he touched down, but very close. 5.7. The judges do not have the benefit of instant replay here. They had it for the first time last season, and we'll have it at Europeans and Worlds this season. First set of marks, 5.1 from the U.S. judge up to a 5.7. That's a wide range, Peter. <laughs> yeah, you bring up such a good point, and that, I think, has to every bit to do with the replay because 5.1 low, obviously, they thought maybe a two-foot for the USA judge, and up to 5.7, giving full credit for the quad. And on the marks for presentation, 5.3 up to 5.6, and Yamato Tamura of Japan breaks into the top three. He's in third, right behind Guo. 